not be appropriate that maybe you had a conversation with her as a representative on the phone and she can't see exactly where we are, so maybe you could call Diego Santana and figure it out at that level, or is it appropriate to put it on the next agenda? Yeah, I, I'm not sure at what level the city can at this point, so if you want to authorize me to talk to Diego Santana about and, the situation, about the situation, yeah. Then I can say that. I, I don't know if, if there's even something that the city can take. That's out. what I mean. So maybe if it were it's a and you, and then you can talk to Diego Santana, right? And sure. See if, that's, if that's what sounds like. Well, that's what I would think. Any other direction? Has there been any contact? Any contact at all with the city? I met with um, Carlos last week who's the probably the only last living soul that works for them <laughs> here in Pro County because they have other developments here in Pro County but he's he can't he's really out of his hands he really can't help it. Do you have any corporate offices or anything else if you try to reach them there? I, I called today and I left a message they only have an answering service. Okay maybe Jennifer could help us out yeah that's great. I appreciate any help. Thank you. Okay, uh, Larry, you came all the way from San Francisco. I understand you have a very short presentation. Are you going to get me to see Nancy Pelosi, you said? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, I'd just uh, like to introduce myself. I'm Larry Del Carlo, President and CEO of Mission Housing Development Corporation. We're a nonprofit affordable housing developer that's based in San Francisco, and we're doing some developments in the uh, Central Valley, and also hopefully we'll be doing some development here in Calexico and other uh, cities in the county. I don't want to say too much because I want to introduce Jaime Gonzalez and Jesus Padron who will uh, give you some more information about the project that we're proposing uh, for Calexico. Is it short? Very short. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. By the way, this is a project at First and Keeper Avenue for those of you who are unfamiliar with it. It's a mixed use housing, 65 apartments, I believe 100 is uh, uh, parking spaces that will go up like four stories, and this is basically what's for being proposed to the city uh, at this time. Still has to go to planning commission, still has to go through all the process. And no parking spaces lost from the downtown merchants. In fact, there are six additional ones. And the idea is to bring an infill to downtown, so we'll have people living there as well as shopping there. sure if mine would fall into that. This is actually in relation to last week's discussion about a charity organization? Uh, yes, sir. So would that be for good for number four, or can I come you forward? You can do it now. Um, I gave some handouts. Probably 